every year we'll complain about this pesky little creature that flies around biting us, buzzing in our ears, and how do you deal with these creatures and help keep them under control? Now, depending on where you live in the world, they're going to be worse in different areas where there's more water, more humidity. When I spent some time in Japan a long time ago, mosquitoes were notorious. And when I was over there on my trip, a lot of people that I knew had these zappers. Now these zappers, this zapper is something that I've used a lot over the years to, to help with mosquitoes. Um, you can also use them with flies uh, and to some degree uh, you can use them with, with other bugs. But it's a great tool to have around to keep them under control, especially when they get into your house. But in Japan, this is this is like a staple with a lot of people just because they have a lot of mosquitoes. Now, I picked this one up at, at Harbor Freight. Uh, this is one that you can get um, on Amazon, and I'll have links in the description below for how you can get it. And it does take uh, two large, I believe they're D batteries, C or D batteries, uh, that go in here. Um, something that you should know related to, let me see what it does take. Uh, it does take D size batteries. You notice that I only have one battery in here. It requires two and that's for a safety reason. This has a lot of voltage going through it when you turn it on and you do not want to touch this surface when it's activated. And when it's activated there's uh, there's a red light here that will illuminate and so when I store it I intentionally keep one of the batteries out so that it will not be dangerous if I accidentally pick it up and turn it on because there's uh, this button here you know, it turns it on and once you press this button it stays electrified for uh, several seconds before it turns off and that's so that you can use it more easily so I do keep that second battery in an easy to reach place near the racket so that I can I can put that in and then um, use it however I need to use it. So if you have small children, you definitely want to keep this put away and keep that uh, and take one of those batteries out so that they don't get into this, play with it and really harm themselves because it can be a very dangerous tool but a very effective one for keeping mosquitoes and other bugs uh, at bay uh, during the spring and summer months especially. So I hope this has been helpful in helping you with dealing with those pesky little bugs that uh, come around especially in the warm months. And if you want more tips like this be sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of the content. And I will look forward to seeing you in the next video.